Good morning. I know it's been a while, but uh, we wanted to give you a farm update and kind of show you a few things that we've been working on. So let's take a walk. So we've been working on a few projects here at the farm. Um, we've got a little bit of equipment, which we'll be going over in different videos, but uh, we have a couple tractors and a few other things um, that'll help us with homesteading. Um, so we're going to take a walk down here and take a look at our goats and the pigs. So here's our goats. So what are the goats' names? This one's Lily and this one's Brittany. Right. We've got a couple of German shepherds that do like to shepherd. So all right, here we go down to the pigs. So you guys going to come along with me today? All right. So we're headed down to the pig pen. Uh, we have six pigs. Two of the breeders are Idaho pasture pigs and we're hoping to be able to get some piglets at uh, the beginning of 2021. So let's take you down there and we'll we'll take a quick look and and give them a little bit of pig food. So we'll go down here and see if we can call in the pigs. Uh, we're trying out the Idaho pasture pigs. It's our first time having pigs, but um, with Idaho pasture pigs, they have a tendency to graze because of the way their snouts are built instead of root, so there's a lot less destruction. But they take better advantage of the uh, of the pasture uh, as they eat grass and a few other things, which which is helpful. So we have them on about five acres and we're going to run some paddock systems through here because obviously the full five, you know, they're, they're able to go and uh, do whatever they want as far as in the trees or in the pasture area. But, um, and this is up in the treed area, but we want to go ahead and in the spring, especially kind of rotate them through. So that way the ground has a little larger chance to heal. So we'll see if we can call them in. Pig! Pig, pig, pig! Come on, pig! Pig, 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 pig! Pig, 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 pig! And there goes the shepherd again. He's actually very concerned about all the animals. He's never caused harm, but he wants to make sure that they're all going in the right direction. So, sort of his natural work, I guess. Hi, guys. Hi. All right, you want to go ahead and throw them some, sure. throw them some food. All right. So Crispy is always the first one. He's kind of a Kind of a jerk. I mean, he, he, I won't cry too much when we turn him into bacon. And then Russell is this uh, brown and black spotted one. He's our, our papered male. And then Miss Piggy is the white and black one back here. And she's the papered sow. Um, again, the wife is the pig expert. I am the fence builder when it comes to this part of it, but um, they do like just about anything, including, yep, take off the stickers. We don't want to feed them stickers. Mm -hmm. That doesn't make very good bacon. So we'll get them some grain here in a little bit. And we like to feed them in different places just so that way um, we can cut down a little bit on the mud. We want to not destroy and have your typical pig pen. We kind of want to have the free range organic pigs is as best we can. You want to give Miss Piggy a little scratch? Yeah. All right. <laughs> Miss Piggy, boy. <laughs> Which the pigs could really care less during feeding time, but we make sure that we can get in there and the kids can supervise, but play with the pigs and touch the pigs and that everybody's friendly because we're not going to have any, any problems. Mm -hmm. So what's the little guy's name? Is it Nikki? Nikki. Yeah. He's so 
told you it's only the last in the lead. Yeah. Nikki, he's a scrapper. He knows how to, you know, get in there and find stuff other people don't. <laughs> Give it to him. Let him go before his buddies steal it. There we go. Go, 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 Nikki, go. Oh, Nikki. Nikki for the win. There you go. <laughs> yeah. So, all right. Are we ready to finish this up and go uh, do the goats? Yeah. All right. Let's go ahead and get them out. All right, so. Okay, so here we go with Ricky. And Lily is gonna dance. Uh, what are we doing? So we have the chicken tractor uh, down in the middle of the field. We need to grab the side-by-side -side and pull that up. We'll have a video on what we did there as far as construction is concerned. Um, do you think Mama's gonna be happy with you eating these? I don't think so. Let's go, come on, let's go, let's go. Let's go, all right, here we go, here we go. You coming? Come on, Lily. Come on, Lily. All right. Are you guys being good? Bear, you being good? That's what I thought. So, we <clears throat> have had the property for about a year. I'll be nice to your goat. He'll come. I know they're stubborn, but we've had this property for about a year. But we've had to, in the time, sell our house and move out. And we haven't really been taking the videos as far as the big adventure is concerned. So one of the things that we need to do is go through and finish some of the drainage that we've been working on. You know, we've built a temporary greenhouse, which we'll go over in a different video, but we want to go through and catch you guys up on all of our progress and the things that we found that have worked and then the things that hasn't worked and um, you know, maybe get your input on, on how to move forward, so. So what do you think there, Ricky? You ready to go to work? Are you ready? Are you ready to go to work? So. All right. So this last spring we did go through and dig out most of the garden area and we were able to plant some potatoes but we're you know and they worked out but we learned some lessons and we need to go ahead and get this stuff ready for overwintering obviously with the excavator and a few other implements that we have um, you know we have some cleanup and things for land management here especially with the pond but uh, for right now we just kind of wanted to give you a little bit of an update on the animals and we'll have some more videos here shortly. Lily, you're doing a beautiful job. Thank you for for turning all this brush into fertilizer. I appreciate it. I really do. All right, we'll be back in a little bit. All right? Oh, no, you can't eat that. <laughs> How you doing? I'm surviving the rainstorm. I, I don't got nothing for you. Night night. Night night grazing. <laughs> 